Phil Bedford here, the Rebel Networker, and today I'm in Dubai with Vern Harnish. And uh, Vern's here to do a presentation. He's got an amazing book called Scaling Up. And for any of you guys out there looking to scale up your businesses, I'm sure this guru here is going to help us. Vern, welcome to Dubai. Good to see you. Pleasure. Yeah. Yeah. So what would your tip be for uh, the uh, watchers of the show? Well, you know, the fundamental weakness of companies scaling up is marketing and separate from sales. Right. And so I said at the feet, at foot, so I said at the feet of Regis McKenna, who's the one who taught Steve Jobs marketing, Intel, Genentech, and at the time in the early 80s, I was building this group called ACE, Association of Collegiate Entrepreneurs, that Michael Dell and Mark Cuban and many others were involved in. And so I said, look, if he's good enough for Steve, he's good enough for me, so I cold called him. He said yes, and I said, Regis, you gotta teach me marketing. He said, he puts his finger up. I said, what's that? He said, the key to marketing first is one hour a week. You have to set that aside. Second, it's all about the network. It's always about the who. And so he set me down and he said, look, what are the top 25 influencers, most important people, you need to somehow or another get to and get on your side to get supportive of what you're doing. And at the time, it was the owner of Inc. Magazine. It was, I wanted Steve Jobs to come to one of our events because he was a big name. We put together this list of 25. And then all we did at this weekly one hour meeting was say, all right, how do we get to that person? Right. How do we go find a way to have breakfast with him, lunch with him, get him involved in what you're doing? And in 36 months, we went from a student organization in one place to global. <laughs> and it culminated in me throwing the party for Steve Jobs when he got fired from Apple. And it was his first public outing. We had almost, um, remember then, almost 1,200 young entrepreneurs from around the world at that event in the Bonaventure Hotel in LA. So, it is all about marketing. It's about understanding who the influencers are and then working that list. And then last, don't forget the fundamental four P's, marketing, product, price, place, and promotion. The biggest weakness, price. Everyone is so focused on the cost side that they miss price. And that's where you leave a lot of money on the table. And so I encourage people to go out and study as much about pricing as they have on the supply side or cost side of the business. One last hint, go out to Ogilvy, one of the largest ad agencies, and look for, you can find it on Google Bing, the four E's of marketing. These four E's have replaced the four P's, and there's this free white paper and PowerPoint you can download. Now you've got an agenda for your one hour marketing meeting that'll keep you busy for the next decade. Wow. So your tips really is look for your top 25 influencers, yeah. and then check out the five E's? Four, four E's. Four E's. That have replaced the four P's. Maybe one day there'll be a fifth E, but for the moment it's four. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant, great tips. Man. Thank you so much for your tips. You're welcome. I really appreciate it. I'm looking forward to seeing you in action in a couple of weeks. All the best.